We make tools ourselves because we have very unique items within the Air Force. With a 3D printer, we can repair our components quicker, safely. We use it to print toolings, fixtures and prototypes with the highest standards. Within the Air Force, there are 7,000 people who work there. About two to 300 people actually fly. The rest of the people are facilitating those guys. The military grade we use for our weapon system is the most demanding of all of our components we use. If those items break down, we just can't hire someone to fix that. We have to do that ourselves. We have created the Maker Shop where everybody within the Air Force can use new technologies like 3D printing to make his or her idea come to life. The majority of people are people who aren't in a technical function. It's very accessible. They only need three hours to really get to know the software and the hardware. And the step that automatically happens after that is that they start looking at their own environment where they work and start searching for solutions for issues they have in their workplace. When we started using the Ultimaker, the engineer could design his own tool or fixture he wanted, print it, and just at that same time look at it and see what he had to change. So the iteration went from months to weeks. A 3D printer should be a regular tool in your set of tools to make stuff. It can be placed everywhere. It isn't strange anymore to have a 3D printer sitting next to your workstation.